Mike Hewitson, Pony, affectionately known as Pony. Um, this is Mr. Paul Owen, and I usually play three synths with La Luna El Estel. I play the Nord Wave, Mini Moog, and my Virus Ti. We come up with lots of different sound effects. We, t we tend to use a lot of nature sound effects, uh, either the sea or the countryside, lots of different animal effects. Uh, also a lot of dialogue in our music. We're here today, we just played Boscom Fair, amongst lots of other local bands in uh, Boscom and Bournemouth sort of area. And uh, we went down quite well, we had about 30, 40 people, which is good for a 20 past four slot in the afternoon, I believe. So, um, thanks to Damien for doing that. Thank you. 
2004. Well, we met before that actually, when we used to play with you. You know, we the uh, first band I was in was Uncle Fester. Then it's a various mental block, reggae outfits. Then it's a funky Bob Noxious. And then the duo Virgo 2, which is myself and Kojo doing Roots Reggae. Um, and also playing in various percussion, backing for various percussion, various people. Um, likes to kick ass on the bass, does our Paul? Yeah, he likes they, the they bass, bass line. Tap, yeah. The bass line is the backbone and the percussion is the heart. Yeah, and then I put lots of space in there, like, because we, we tend to get influenced by Hawkwin and Austro Tentacles and a lot of progressive rock bands from my side. And then also, you get a lot of Eno influences. Yeah, yeah sure, Frank Gallus, Eno, Jean Michel Jarre, uh, The Orb especially. The Orb is quite mixed up with a lot of the stuff we do. So uh, there's modern influences and there's also retro influences there, as far back as the late 60s to early 70s. Also, Delia Dark. Make a mention of her. We like Carlos, fantastic.
anyone want any more? Yeah! yeah. Do you want to? Rock and roll. Yeah, what, what kind of stuff do you want? Because me and Paul can see, you know, it'd have to be like either dancing or ambient or somewhere in between or something. Lots of Tangerine Dream, Klaus Schultz, all the top ambient people, you know, and we do like Osric Tentacles. So, uh, so have you got any favourites in that era? And, and I like so many, you know, I like everything, basically. I can't, you know, Osric stand out quite a lot. Punch and the Fulgen's probably my favourite, and Jurassic Shift as well. So we get a lot of influence. too far away, so it was quite a recent one. Recent one, yeah, 30 years ago, it was really yeah. nice. In fact, most of the albums are just top. Fantastic, yeah. I'd say Osric's on this, you know. They've influenced many, many bands, haven't they? As well as lots of proper rock, you know, Genesis, yeah. Yes. You know, Keith Emerson's one of my favourites. I managed to see Emerson Lake and Palmer probably on their last gig at Floyd 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 Festival this year. Yeah, so yeah. Pink Floyd is a major influence on me. Floyd definitely. Yeah, yeah. Early and Floyd as well. Um, from Moore and Relics and Zabriskie Point. We um, just have to sit back. Okay. I'm a gummer. I'm sorry we have to leave you so soon, but thank you ever so much. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks so much. <laughs>